Hi everybody, welcome to class. My name is Teacher Chad and this hour we are going to be uh, practicing our reading and pronunciation as we read through a short story that is entitled Justice. Okay, the uh, sh short story, the link to the short story is in the chat box right now. Let me get that to you. If verbling chat is working. All right, let me uh, come leave and come right back in. Looks like uh, Hangouts froze. Right. So we. All right. There we go. Hi. Hi. I needed to right. jolt the system one more time. Uh, <laughs> awesome. How you doing, Mario? I'm doing great, uh, Chad. Uh, what about you? I'm doing good. I'm doing really good. Thank you for asking. Yeah. Let's see. How about uh, Daniela? How are you? Fine. Thanks, you. Good. Good. Nice to see you. Yeah. Amparo, how are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. You? I'm doing good, thank you for asking. Uh, <laughs> Lily, how are you doing, Lily? I'm great, thank you. How about you? I'm well, thank you for asking. You're welcome. Very good, you guys. Okay, let's uh, let's go ahead and uh, and get started. Um, probably have some other stragglers coming in as we uh, get into this story, but uh, we can. Go ahead and start it up. All right, this story is entitled Justice. Okay, written in 2005. All right, let's uh, let's start off with uh, Amparo. Hey, Laszlo, how you doing? Hello, teacher. Hi, good to see you. Hello, hello, thank you. All right, Amparo, uh, let me have you uh, start here at the beginning and read through the first, uh, let's see, the first couple paragraphs. So uh, I hung down to a departure, please. Okay. I cannot see it in your, your screen. Let me try. Okay. I hung up the telephone and with a sigh stumbled down the hall. Robin slipped, slipped from my eyes. Standing before the sink, I tried to remember which knot to use, which really didn't matter, because each produced only cold water. I knew this, but for some reason thought it was advisable to alternate. So I always did it, maybe just for the hell of this. By the time I had dry off, I was fully awake. My watch was 3 a.m. Managing a small airport was a job not always fi filled with excitement and romance. Sometimes it became one of her war and little sleep. This particular Saturday morning, I felt romance and excitement were out, and that her work and little sleep were in. The owner on the single engine beach bonanza wanted his ship, ship out of the hangar for a 4 a.m. departure. Okay, all right, very good. Um, first off, mm -hmm. um, the first to sleep um, was almost there, the second sleep was great. Okay, and uh, so was the third one. Okay, so those two were really good. All right, I saw you kind of uh, focus on those and get that E sound there. That was really nice. Okay, um, uh, ship was good as well. Okay, getting that short I in there. All right, now engine. Okay, so this is a single engine instead of single engine. Single engine. Try that. 
single engine. There you go. Okay. Uh, let's go to hard work. Hard, hard work. work. That's it. You want to get that D in there. D if not, it sounds like hard work. Yeah. Okay. okay. So one more time. Hard work. Hard work. Good. Good. Uh, let's go to fully, uh, fully awake. There it is. So getting the we need the K at the end. Fully awake. Fully awake. There you go. And last word, alternate. Um, the A T E alternate. at the end. Alternate. 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 Uh huh. Now, um, uh, advisable to alternate. Um, let's see here. By the time I had to dry off, uh, I. Nope, 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 nope. Uh, thought it was advisable to alternate. 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 Oh, no, I apologize. Okay, so they're using this. Okay, so when you are an alternate player. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, so an extra player or an alternate. Okay, we would say alternate. Uh, if you're using it as a verb, um, it would be to alternate, and that's when we would pronounce eight. Okay, I I was reading through that and I I I thought it was a noun for some reason, so I wrote it down. Uh, okay, so here if we're using this as a verb, just like how you would how you had said it, um, then yes, we would say alternate. Okay. Alternate. Okay. But if you, it is an alternate part or an alternate player on a team, it would be knit, mm -hmm. alternate, instead of alternate. Okay. okay? Oh, yeah. It's different right. the pronunciation. It's, it's a noun or a verb. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, very good Thanks. job. Thanks. Excellent. Uh, hey, Alex, how you doing, Alex? I'm doing good. Great. Good to have you Thanks. here. Uh, let me have you continue reading, please. Uh, please read the second, uh, well, let's see, the next three paragraphs. So from nine aircraft down to bit dark. Nine aircraft were based at Vossel Field during summer at 9 and 60. All nine were safely anchored inside a large wooden building a thousand feet from my office. Some made recurring flights during the week, but all were certain to fly out of either Saturday or Sunday when the weather was nice, which is usually was which it usually was in central Alabama in late May. My problem was that the owner's departure winds were unpredictable. It seemed no matter no matter which plane I parked in the rear of that hangar, it was sure to be the first one to hang out on a weekend morning. Leaving the office, I pulled the door closed and walked down the shallow incline, incline, grumbling to myself in the chilly darkness. Because the hangar opened, opened only at the one end, I would have to drop maybe six or more airplane planes outside before getting to the Bonanza. The one hour's notice helped. I could I could do it on thir in 40 minutes and those days moving our planes was all done my hand. Ducks and tongue motors were to be found only up in the larger airports. My mood was a bit dark. Okay, very good. Uh, let's check out some words here, Alex. Uh, first up is air, airplanes. Airplanes. There you go. Yeah, so that would not be our, our planes, but air, airplanes. okay? Yeah. Um, uh, shallow incline. So our stress is going to be here at the beginning instead of at the end of the word. Incline. Incline. Good, good. Uh, let's go to walked. Um, so here, uh, yes, it is an ah sound, but uh, that L is going to be silent. So it wouldn't be walk, walked, okay? Uh, walked. Take that L out, wa, walked. Walked. There you go, okay? Um, let's go to want out. Um, here you had, uh, you had read the word uh, differently. I'm not, ex I can't remember exactly what you said, but this is uh, to want out. Um, oh, yeah, to hang out is what you said. You said hang out. Oh, so, uh, to, uh, <laughs> to want out. <laughs> yeah, to want out on a weekend morning, okay? One more time. To want out on a weekend morning. To want out on a weekend morning. Okay, very good. Let's go to recurring right here. Recur. So that U-R is an er sound. Recurring. Recur. Recurring. 
There you go. Okay, this word is hangered. So hangered. even though this is an AR, instead of hangard, hangered. Hangered. All right, and that's like parking an airplane. Okay, okay. so that's uh, being under, uh, if, if you've seen maybe, uh, you may have seen it in person or on TV or on the movies, those big dome type places where airplanes, um, it's like the airplane garage. Okay, the, yeah. the airplane garage is called a hangar. Okay. Okay. Um, and this is 1960. Make make sure to pronounce either 60 with a T at the end or a D at the end. 60 or 60. Okay. Nine and 60. Okay. Very good. Nice job. Thank you, Alex. Oh. All right. Let's go to Daniela. Yeah. All right, Daniela. Uh, please continue where it says the bonanzas. The bonanzas mm -hmm. drone. Uh, finish this one. This next paragraph. And let's see, and this uh, this third one here. So read down to his new ship, please. Okay. The Bonanza's drone padded into the distance as I closed and locked the office door. Then I collapsed on the hold of sitting. I was sound asleep when my text customer arrived. He was pounding on the door as I walked. We entered the office, made for the coffee urn, that helped himself to a hot cup of the several days old overcooked brew. He took a, a swallow, then gargled. I looked up to see him staring at me with the expression of a man who had just detected an unpleasant aroma in a crowded, slow-moving elevator. For thought he blinked his eyes rather rap rapidly. He did not complain. He knew I had not yet cleaned the one week accumulation of anger, dust and beard put from the windshield of his new Chesena 210. Instead, sent the mouth down on the counter, he looked at his watch and croaked. I need to be leaving now. Can you go ahead and get my ship ready for me? I knew what this wasn't a request. It was more of an order, but hey, that was my job. We walked down to his new ship. Okay, very good job. Uh, let's uh, take take a look here. Uh, first up, first up is croaked, croaked with a T ending. Mm -hmm. Croaked. Okay, uh, you're saying cro, croaked. It is cro, croaked. Uh, croaked. There you go. One more time. Croaked. Croaked. There you go. Good. Let's go to bird poop. All right. So bird poop. Bird poop. Okay. Give me that D at the end. Bird. Bird yeah. poop. Bird poop. There you go. Good. Good. All right. Let's go to uh, cleaned. Uh, let's see here. Right here. So uh, you had said cleaned. This is a D ending. Cleaned. Cleaned. Good, good, nice job. Uh, let's go to blinked. Okay, with the T ending, blinked. Blinked. Excellent. And this word would be detected. Detected. Good. One more time. Detected. Detected. All right. Very good. Let's go to right up, uh, right up above. So the U R here is going to make an er sound. So instead of gurgled, it is gur, gurgled. 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 Excellent. One more time. Gurgled. Gurgled. Nice. And uh, up here on this ne this uh, first line, collapsed. Collapsed. Good. One more time. Collapsed. Collapsed. Very good. And let's practice uh, as I closed. Okay, those three words. As I closed. As I closed. Good. Nice job. All right, very good, very good job. Let's go to uh, Dua. Hello. Hi there, Dua. How are you? I I'm fine, sir. What about you? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. Uh, let me have you continue uh, where it says uh, 20 minutes later. Okay, so from 20 okay. minutes later down to. I'm sorry, uh, but I don't have this paper. How can I read? Could you please give me the link? Sure. The link is in the uh, chat box right now. 
Oh, I think she should click on your icon. She she's new. Okay. Oh, and she's also in the other one. Um, yeah. All right. So, Dua, there's uh, there's two things that uh, that you can do here. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, let's go right here. All right. So take a look here on uh, on the screen. Do you see my mouse down below on the right hand side? Do you see my mouse here? Mo uh, it's moving it. Mm. It's moving in a circle. Down I below. Do you see why I don't have chat room. The chat room okay. is in development. Um, because you you're right. using the the share 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 screen. She's using the share screen. Oh, is she on shared? Yeah. Okay. Mm -mm. Um, all right. Do what? Mm -hmm. Over on the left-hand side, over on the left-hand side, you see where there's a red button that says invite people? It says invite people. Do you see that? No, I don't see it. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, um, yeah. On, uh, I. I. You, you need to look for a, a a green button on the left. Okay. That says uh, screen share and click off that. That will uh, that will help you be able to see uh, see what we're what we're doing. But I, I sent you the uh, the link in uh, the chat box as well. You should be able to uh, get that. Ah, it's all. You have it closed. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah. Okay. So, do what? Where your where your mouse is? Okay. Uh oh. No. Go. Okay. All right. We'll do it. Let me uh, keep uh, keep working on it. Um. I sent you the link in the chat box. Right now you're in uh, screen share. Okay. Um. And do what? What language do you speak? Arabic. Um, Goliath, could you help yeah. her? Do you, do you speak yeah. Arabic? What do you uh, want to say to her? Um, uh, guide her so that she can get off okay. of screen share and then, uh, and, then, and then open up her chat box. Uh, her chat box, uh, uh, Dua? Yeah, yeah. Uh, the chat is on the chat. I know, I know. It isn't available for me. I, I don't know why. Okay, uh, I can't help here. <laughs> so just um, open the open the, the 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 link and in the chat box and follow. That's yeah. She doesn't. Uh, she doesn't, doesn't, have no, right. she doesn't have it available. but it's weird. She doesn't have it. She doesn't have it open open to her right now. It's very very strange. Okay. All right. She has, well, a, she has a, a fake hangout maybe. <laughs> maybe. All right, Dua, the only thing that I could suggest is to leave the Hangout and then come right back in, okay? Uh, but, uh, yeah, I've got, to, uh, I've got to continue on. So that's the only thing that I could suggest, leaving and coming right back in to see if it uh, jolts the system, okay? okay. Uh, Goliath, let's, let's go to you. Let me have you read the next two paragraphs, starting with minutes later, going to now available. Goliath? Uh oh. Yeah, sorry, oh, I lose Goliath. Okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. I was muted. Minutes later, the 210 was airborne. I shaded my eyes with my hands in the usual way and squinted into the summer dawn made red by the mist. He he awkward landing gear made the departing Pesna. Look like a bird when uh, with the broken legs as uh, the spring steel struts swung slowly into the gabin fuselage. Wells uh, and uh, her oblong gear door closed to hide them from the slipstream. This was the initial production year for the Cessna 2010. To my knowledge, she was the first high wing single engine airplane. Having re retractable recycle landing gear, swept tail tails and three color paint schemes had uh, made their debut, deb debut 
into the aircraft market. That industry had learned from the U.S. automakers, the big three, three, Cessna, Piper, and Beach, uh, each braked braked uh, the competition. Braked the competition by trying to offer a model just a little bit faster, just a bit cheaper, or perhaps just a bit more comfortable than the closest uh, competitor. Many choices were now available. My God, that's this. So, <laughs> yeah, in the nice first job, paragraph, yeah. uh, in the first paragraph, I was, uh, I they made me sweat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you had. We have uh, some new words here. All right, let's uh, let's check some out. Uh, this last one here uh, that you went through was is bracketed, bracketed, bracketed. That doesn't mean this bracket. I thought it was uh. break. From break, no, it's what it has C, yeah. Bracketed? Yeah, each bracketed the competition, okay? Now, here's our definition. By trying to offer, okay, a model just a little bit faster, okay? So, uh, bracketed would be to hold back the competition here, okay? So, by mm -hmm. inventing something that was a little bit better than someone else's plane. Yeah. Okay? So, so a, a bracket... A bracket is something that uh, that holds uh, holds something uh, back or holds something uh, up to a wall or something like that. Basically, it holds something. Yeah, like okay. in brackets so, in the text. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. So um, when they say that they bracketed, they're they're holding back the competition. Okay, trying to be better than they are. No, okay? okay. All right. Our our next word here is debut. Debut. Debut without T. Yeah, without the T, debut. Okay, French word. Okay. Um, uh, up next is tricycle. This means three wheels. Tricycle. Mm -hmm. Tricycle, yeah. Okay. Uh, let's uh, let's work on the uh, long A, gay, gaping. 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 Uh huh. And the okay. next one. And the next one. Fuselage. Fuselage. You were you were pretty good on that. Fuselage. I said fuselage. <laughs> I like French. <laughs> yeah, Fus and, and some fuselage. people call that the, the fuselage, and others call it the fuselage. Okay, mm -hmm. and that's the uh, the the main, uh, I guess, cabin or or whatnot of the airplane. Okay, the fuselage, at least from what I understand. Um, and then uh, let's see, awkward. So we had two A W words instead awkward. of ow. Yeah, awkward. awkward. Okay, and dawn instead of down. Dawn. dawn. There you go. That's it. Yeah. Okay. okay, nice job. Yeah, thanks. Okay, let's go to Laszlo. Okay. All right, Laszlo, let me have you continue uh, with Beach. Okay, and have you read the next two paragraphs, please. Uh, okay. Uh, Beach uh, had red, red, uh, red, uh, red designated the twin Bonanza that became its cabin class Queen Air. Cessna would not produce the cabin class aircraft for another four years. Piper, with the exception of the Pavn crop dusted, had yet the products, the low wing single. Out through its twin Apache, with the addition of the large slab tail and large engine became the Piper uh, A-Stack. Designed the chow to away, the, uh, away at the Cessna uh, 310 market. The weather forecast in Mont Montgomery had pred predicted skittered variable the broken clouds with six miles visitably in haze which caused me to accept the busy day. Six miles visibility was less than a lot of great ma majority of weekend pilots flying, fly, uh, flying the skies. Most flew sans radio. Uh, pilotage and deed reckoning were their only navigation tools. Pilotage invo involved reading the aviation chart and simply looking down the sea on the ground. What was the piece on the chart? 
did reckoning involved using time speed distance. Calculations made prior to the flight and also during flight to determine when and when ought to be. Okay, nice job, last flow. Let's practice some Thank words. You. First up is ought instead of out, ought. Out, out. Okay, uh, only an ah sound. Okay, so uh, so try and lean off of that oo. Okay, you're saying ow. Okay, ow. it is only ah, ought, ought. Out, out, ought. Okay, there, that's it. Ah, ah, out, ought, out. Okay, okay. take out that oo sound. Take out the oo. You're saying ow. We want to say an ah only. Ah, ought, ought. Ought. Nope. Ow. Okay, so. All right, so look here in the in the chat box, okay, Laszlo? The the O U G H only makes an ah sound. Oh, oh, oh. Instead of there, you go, and then add a T. Ah, t, ah, t. Out, out. Ah, t. Okay. Ah, t. ah, t. ah. T. There you. Go. That's it. Good. Oh, ah. T. Okay. 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 No, no ah. ooh there. Okay. Ah. Very good. All right, let's go to this word here. This word is prior instead of prior, prior. 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 Good, good. Okay, this word here is depicted. Depicted. Excellent. Very good, ED. Um, this one here is involved. Involved. Good, one more time. Involved. Involved. Good, good. Let's go to... Pilotage. Pila, pilotage. Try that. Pilotage. Good. Pilotage. One more time. Pilotage. Pilotage. Very good. Um, let's go to majority right here. Majority. 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 Okay. Okay. On your R sound, make sure not to not to uh, pronounce a hard R. Okay, majority, 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 majority. Good, good. All right, let's go to caused. Caused. Okay, instead of ow. Okay, caused. just like the word ought, we say caused. 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 There, that's it. Caused. Caused. Excellent. Okay. Now this uh, this here this is a name of a plane or a actually a brand of a plane like Toyota or Honda. Okay, this is the okay. brand of a plane. It is Cessna. 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 Uh huh. There you go. Cessna. Okay. Uh, exactly. Let's go to produce. Right here. Produce. 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 Uh huh. Um, exception. Right here. Exception. 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 Good. And last word, uh, redesigned. 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 Good, good. All right. Nice job, Laszlo. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Uh -huh. Let's go to Lily. All right, Lily, uh, please read the next two paragraphs. So from pilot maintaining to visibility these days. Or sorry, visibility days. Okay. Pilot maintaining head headings based upon predest predicted when calculator were subject to the inaccuracies of winds when the loft forecast. The nation's first weather satellite Taurus One launched April first day that year had yet to revolutionize aviation, weather, forecasting, and I knew I could count on getting my share of lost, lost pilot that hazy Saturday. Brazil, Brazil Field was located some distance from a large lake. This, this terrain had little in the way of distinct landmark marks, and the lake drew and lake drew, drew lost pilots like a ma magnet. 
a pipeline, pipeline and a power line crossing each other at at a shallow angle near to the to the lake led to confusing some for some the pipeline connected petroleum terminals in Atlanta, Atlanta with the rich oil fields and re refineries of southern Louisiana. Some pilots mistook it for the power line and following it instead would pass close enough to my airport to spot the field on all but very worst visibility days. Okay, very good. Uh, let's uh, take a look at some words here. First up is refineries. 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 Uh -huh. One more time. Refineries. Refineries. Good. Um, this word would be pipeline. Pipeline. All right. Very good. Um, and yes, you pronounce this uh, pretty close, okay? It is magnet. 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 Okay. Um, good. Let's go to distinct, uh, which is, oh, right here. Distinct. Distinct. Good. One more time. Distinct. Distinct. Okay. Um, and let's go to the ow sound. This word would be count. Count. Okay, one more time. Count. Count. Uh huh. And good job with uh, revolutionize and aviation. Those sounded really good. Nice job. Um, let's go to inaccuracies. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, calculations. Calculations. Okay, give me a EU, calc -U, calculations. Calculations. Very good. And the word based. Now, you, here you said based. Okay, use an unvoiced S, based. Based. Okay, just like that. Nice job. Okay, very good, Lily. Thank you. Let's go to uh, Mario uh, Bafau. How, yes. how would I pronounce your last name, Mario? Bafu. Bafu, okay. Yes. All right, Bafu. Bafu. All right, gotcha. Yes. Gotcha, Bafu. Okay, so um, Mario, please read the next three paragraphs. So from viewed by the air, uh, uh, sorry, viewed from the air to true ego buster. Okay. Can you please? Uh, uh, okay, yeah, great. Okay, viewed, viewed from the air pipeline and the power, power line looks similar, like a swath cut across the Earth's surface by a giant lawnmower. However, however, the latter swath has poles based equidistantly along its length. A sharp eye gazing without prejudice or no panic can tell the di difference. The power line diverge not far from my field to lead its followers towards other airports. Most highways and most railroads twisted and wound, wound across the state. Small towns appeared similar from the air. From the air. It was easy for a pilot to become lost on a hazy day in my part of Alabama. Lost, those pilots who had found themselves in such predicaments were less than willing to admit it. After, after all, pilots are proud of their navigational abilities. The safety of flight depends upon this necessary skill. A hot rocks pilot who has managed to convince himself that he his god god's gift to aviation so would sooner take a whip whipping than suffer the incredible embarrassment attendant upon admitting being lost after all his incredible 
credibility, his reliability, and his prowess were at stake, not to mention his valued reputation. No, being lost was a, was a true ego buster. All right, very good, very good here. All right, let's, uh, let's go to reliability first. Reliability. Reliability. Okay, Re rely. Rely. Uh -huh. Reliability. Re re reliability. Okay, give me that I, that long I there. Rely, reliability. Reliability. Good, one more time. Reliability. R reliability. Good, good. Now this is uh, this would be uh, to rely on someone and uh, ab the ability to do so. Okay, so uh, trust trustworthy trustworthiness or to like count on someone being there. Reliability. Okay. Reliability. That's it. Very good. So if someone is reliable, okay. So if I have an employee that's reliable, that means that they show up on time. Okay, they show up every day. Okay, uh, rarely do they call in sick, and then they get their work done. Okay, so that means that I don't have to be watching over them all day long, okay, to make sure that that person is doing the work. They are, they are a reliable person, okay? Now, uh, this phrase here, I love this phrase. Not <laughs> to aviation, but uh, God's gift to anything. So it's usually used when you're talking about a man who believes he is God's gift to women, okay? Um, most of us have met uh, a man that is like that, okay? Who believes that they are the most perfect individual and all women like, like him. Um, and we would say he's God's gift to women, or he believes that. Um, and so it's like saying that he, uh, he thinks that he's the greatest person on earth, which, uh, and it's, it's a put down, okay? So you're yeah. saying that it's not actually what it is, okay? All right, so I wanted to point that out. This is a great phrase to learn, you guys, okay? Okay. All right, this word here, convince. Convince. There you go. Yep. Stress on the on the end. Convince. One more time. Convince. Awesome. Uh, let's take a crack at the word railroads. Okay. So that L and the R right there in the middle is kind of difficult. Yeah. Railroads. Railroad. Rail. Okay. Rail. Roads. Yeah, just like Rail. that. Railroads. Railroads. Good. Good. Yeah. So your tongue. Sorry, your tongue is going to come up with the L and then come right back down. Railroads. Okay. Rail so try that one. Road. Okay. Rail there you go. Road. Okay, okay. good. Railroads. Rail awesome. Man. Rail. Railroad. Good, good. Uh, let's go to uh, diverged. Okay. Diverged, you said this great. All we need is that D at the end. Okay, the word is. The word is diverged. Diverge. Okay, good. One more time with the D. Di you're saying diverge perfectly, okay. but we need a, a D ending. Diverged. 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 Uh, that. There, that's it. Diverged. Diverged. Good, good, good. All right, and let's go to uh, ladder. Okay, so the ladder swath. The ladder, the ladder swath, swath. There you go. The ladder swath. The ladder swath. Good. Yeah. So we had some tricky words in there for you this time. Yeah. Very, very good, Mario. Nice. Okay. Thank you. All right. You, let's Chad. go to uh, Mario GC. The second Mario. Mario, can you hear me? All right, let's go uh, to uh, uh, Dua. Yes, I'm, I'm Hi here. Hi there. Yeah. Uh, okay, yeah. can you see uh, see what we are reading now? Yeah, I can. Great, A great. A pilot would sooner... Uh -huh. All right, yep, go ahead. Go ahead and start it up. I'll tell you when to stop. Okay. A pilot would sooner admit forgetting to check his fuel or oil caps or forgetting to unite the aircraft's tail before trying to taxi 
from the parking area than he would do admit being lost. How could a pilot holding reasonable self-esteem ever admit being lost? No, a lost pilot landed then spent his time trying hard not to look lost. He would not add and smiled politely at other aviators as he wondered about it, hopes someone standing around might mention the name of the airport or of Hi. the nearest town, the nearest town. Uh -huh. Okay, keep going please. Nonchalantly, the lost airman would read the sign on the ha hangar, he would recon reconnoiter the parking lot, he would examine wall calendars and ask to see the telephone book. By then, the restaurant had opened, so I detoured on the way back to the office, cutting across the, gra the gravel parking lot and the two-lane carved drive, which circled back to the state highway. A short while later, with a tummy full of Zeke's pancakes, I found my mood had improved considerably, and I went about the business of running a small airport. My All right, just tell there. Okay. Just tell there. Okay. Very good. Thank you. Very good reading. Let's uh, let's take a look at some words we can practice. Okay, Dua. Okay. Uh, first up is curved. Instead of curved, curved. Curved. Good. Curved. One more time. Curved. Curved. Good. Now this word, instead of gravel, it is gra, gravel. Gravel. Nice, gravel. nice, very good. Okay, this word is detoured. Detoured. Okay, detoured. Detoured. Can you show me this word exactly where it is? Uh, sure, I'll put it in the uh, chat box here. D toward, like that. Yeah, D tour, toured. D toured. There you go. D toured. D toured. There, D that's it. Nice. Uh huh. Just like that. Okay. Um, okay. Let's go to the word hanger instead of hunger. Hey, hanger. <coughs> hanger. Hanger. Nice. Very, very good. Okay. Um, the word hopes. Okay, instead of hops, ho, hopes. Ho, hopes. Very hopes. good. Nice. Let's practice the P sound. On the word politely, you had said politely, uh, pronouncing a B there at the very beginning. Okay, this is with a P sound, politely. Politely, politely. Very, uh huh, very good, politely. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, next word is trying. Okay, here you said uh, trying. Okay, we want to pronounce a CH sound at the beginning of the word. Okay, so instead of uh, a TR, think of a CHR. Chur, trying. Try that. Trying. Trying. That's it. Trying. Really good. Uh huh. One more time. Trying. 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 Very excellent. And last word. This word up at the very on the very first line is fuel. 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 Good. One more time. Fuel. 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 Good. Very good. Thank you, Dua. Mm -hmm. Thanks All to right. you, sir. Uh-huh. Uh, let's go to uh, the very top one more time. Amparo, let me have you continue reading. Uh, please finish up this, uh, this paragraph, starting at much of this. Okay. And uh, go to the end of the second one. Free coffee. Much of this consists of airing tires, pumping gas, washing airplanes, and in those days, cheerfully swinging props on those craft not having electric starters, answering the telephone, and sometimes having to run a hundred yards to do so kept me from getting out of shape. Mid-morning arrived, an angry orange sun beat through the haze. Several airplanes had landed and I found myself busy as the pilot launch filled with 
with transients and locals. All talking, pilot talk. The visitors were easy to spot. They were the ones holding the mugs on my free coffee. All right, very good. Uh, let's go to visitors. Okay, give me short eyes. Visitors. Visitor. Visitors. Good. Um, this is transients. The stress is at transients. the very beginning. Oh, okay, transients. Mm -hmm. And uh, give me a short I on busy. Instead of BC, busy. 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 That's it. Okay. Very good job. Thank you. Thanks. Uh, let's go to Daniela. Yeah. All right, Daniela, uh, please continue on uh, the next paragraph, uh, reading at suddenly, and I'll have you, okay? Yeah. Uh, that... Yeah, go ahead and, uh, and uh, finish, finish this, uh, this next paragraph, okay? So okay. on suddenly down to uh, fireplace, okay? Okay. Suddenly, her well-dressed pilot looking to be in his middle 20s pushed through the door. As he approached the counter, I detect an obvious air of arrogance. I see the scarf dangled loosely around his neck with one of its hands hanging down his back. The leather jacket was correctly unzipped and his sunglasses were pushed up into his hair above his forehead. The narrative was secreted by a rather large golden wing tie clip. If any doubt remained that he was an aviator, an oversight pilot with wristwatch waiting his left wrist dispelled the notion that notion notion. Many would have been proud to have please placed that timepiece on the center of their mantelpiece above a suitable fireplace. Okay. Excellent. Let's take a look at some words. First up is suitable, a suitable fireplace. Suitable? Uh huh. Suitable. Uh, suitable, with the stress at the beginning. Suitable. Suitable. Good, good. Okay. Uh, uh, let's go to um, dispelled that notion. Dispelled that notion. Can you show me? Uh huh. The word, yeah. Please? Sure, I'll put it in the uh, the chat box. Okay, um, dispelled that notion. Dispelled that notion. Uh huh. Very good. Very good. Okay, let's go to golden wing clip. Or sorry, uh, golden winged tie clip. Golden wing. Golden. Clip. Yeah, golden wing. Uh, golden winged tie clip. Golden wing tie clip. Okay, very nice. All right, let's go to unzipped. Okay. Unzipped. Un yeah. So instead of zipped, unzipped. Unzipped. Okay, excellent. Uh, let's go to uh, hanging. Uh, so you need to pronounce that uh, H sound here instead of hanging. Hey, hanging. Hanging. Uh-huh. Nice job. And last word up on, uh, I believe it's the first line. The word is pushed. Pushed. Okay, with an uh. Uh-huh. That's it. Okay, very good. Thank you. Okay. All right. Thanks. Let's uh, let's go to Goliath. All right. Goliath, uh, please read these next two lines, or two uh, mini paragraphs in uh about half of this, uh, half of this third one. So read down to where it says, sweater she wore. Okay. He looked at me and ordered, I want you to top off both tanks with 80 octane. octane. Dip, the oil, dip the oil, then come back and tell me what it reads. Ja Jake B., my friend from the cotton mill, had overhead the order. I stiff. I stifled a smile when ja Jake made the lewd gesture behind the man's back. I hastened to the pilot biting, trotting down to the gas pit where his red and silver Cessna 140 was parked. Reaching the, ch uh, the ship, I spied the, uh, the very pretty lady perched 
in the co-pilot si seat, climbing, climbing uh, the ladder in front of the wing. I stole several glances. Her clear face and sparkling eyes were framed by soft brown hair that's draped. I don't know, draped or draped. <laughs> I'll try draped forward. Uh, of the huh? You were right the first time, draped. Draped, okay. Forward of the shoulders, contrasting warmly with the tan and rather promising sweater uh, she wore. All right, very good. Uh, let's check out some words. First up is hastened. That T is going to be silent. Hastened. What is it? Uh, top of the uh, third paragraph. Or the big, that big one you read, hastened. Yeah. Hastened, and what is it? Um, uh, to hurry. Okay, so I hurried to do the pilot's bidding. No, how would, how we pronounce it? Uh, you had you had said hastened, and uh, the T is silent. Hastened. Hastened. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, this word here is stifled. Stifled. Mm -hmm. Stifled. Uh huh. Very good. Okay. Uh, let's go to overheard. Okay. Make sure you're pronouncing an er sound. Overheard. O overheard. There you go. And octane, here at the very beginning, we do pronounce that ain, octane. Uh -huh. That's one of the rare, where, rare times when we actually do. Octane is, octane is eight already. Why 80 octanes? 80 octane. It's, um, in, in the United States, we have different uh, levels uh, of octane. I don't know exactly what or why they have them. I just know one is more expensive than the other. It goes like uh, you have 80, 90, and like 95, or it's 80, 85, and 90, something like that. Um, and it uh, has something to do with the way that the gasoline burns. Um, so yeah, mm -hmm. one is better than the other, and one is cheaper than the other as well. So 80 octane would be the cheaper, cheaper of the three. Mm -hmm. Okay? All right, very good. Let's go to uh, Juan. Uh, Chad, Chad, just one yes. question. Yes. I'm uh -huh. sorry, I'm abusing, I know. Uh, someone asked me if uh, French uh, could have uh, a plural uh, like Frenches. What do you think? Frenches? Yeah, we can say Frenches. Uh, French are the French, a French, one French, many French. Yeah, it's not, it okay. wouldn't be it wouldn't be plural. Um like, it, it can like be advice. possessive. It would. It wouldn't be. It wouldn't be plural, but it can be possessive. It's the mm -hmm. French's painting. Okay, so okay. it belongs to the people wow. of France. So it doesn't take the s of uh, of a plural. Yeah, it it doesn't. It doesn't take a. a yeah, it, you can't. Uh, you can't make French uh, plural. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Sure. Thank you. No problem. Um, all right, let's go to Laszlo. Oh, sorry. No, no, Juan. Okay. Okay, Juan. Um, so from when she smiled, okay, uh, finish off that paragraph, and I'll have you read until my innards tightened. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Uh, when she smiled at me, I almost overfilled the left, the left tank. My eyes took in slender wrists and delicate hands, stopping, and they came to the gold wedding ensemble encircling her third third finger. I finished the refueling operation, checked the oil level, then walked slowly back toward the office. Two airplanes were in the pattern. Our green and silver Cessna 150 followed on downwind by a bright red Taylor Craft L2. The Cessna was over the threshold. I stopped to watch as the pilot flared about 20 feet, about 20 feet too high above the pavement. My innards tightened. I suppose, I suppose he did too, because just then I heard the room, boom, of the hundred horsepower. Continental, as she, 
as he poured on the coal, aborting the landing attempt and climbing away from the runaway. Okay, good. Now this word here at the very end would be runway. Runway. Okay, oh, runaway. Uh huh. Yeah. So runway. Runaway is someone that uh, uh, leaves home. Runway is uh, where airplanes land. Okay. <laughs> Um, let's go to Cessna. Okay, um, this is the name of a plane that is going to be a double S. Okay, that would be a uh, a unvoiced S sound. So Cess Cessna instead of says it is Cess. Try that. Cessna. Okay, very good. Uh, let's go to uh, over. Uh, so over. over. Uh oh, where'd you go over? Oh, okay, right here. So was over over the th the uh, threshold. Try that. Over the, th the threshold. Okay, good. That's yep. Awesome. Focusing on that V, and let's go to t -t -t ensemble wedding. No, 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 no. Two. Okay, so. Uh, when when we pronounce two, um, you're you're uh, dipping into that ooh, saying do. Okay, so it's just uh, nice and nice and soft on two. Okay, so two airplanes. Try that. Two airplanes with that with the T as well. Okay, two airplanes. Try that. Two airplanes. Yep, just like that. Two airplanes. Okay, okay. nice and uh, nice and easy. You don't need to press into that ooh. Okay. Two airplanes. Um, yeah, everything. Yep, just like that. Everything else was uh, was really good. Nice job. Nice job. Um, very good. Uh, let's see here. Yep, no problem, no problem. All right, you guys, um, I need to uh, roll on to my next class. Thank you guys for for coming. I've got to start my next one so it uh, starts up, okay? Uh, Mario, I... You forgot of me. I, I did not, I did not forget you, Mario. I called your name a few times and you did not uh, answer. So I had to, I had to move on, okay? My, my I do apologize. My is, isn't work. Yeah, I I'm a, I apologize, but uh, I did call your name a few times, and I didn't hear from you, uh, nor in the chat box. Okay, so I, I needed to move on, and I'm out of time. Okay, all right, thanks, guys. Okay. We'll see ya. Thank Bye. You.